this is t set abcd and welcome to another katan video here on my channel so this is my seventh placement game for the road to top 100 this season and uh, yeah i'm in the fourth position of late i have slightly started disliking fourth position i like being uh, first or second i believe i have a better win percentage there but uh, I mean, this is surely a part of my game that I need to improve because it is completely random. So now let's take a look at the board. Goes for 8, 5, 10. Yeah, decent pick. I think uh, 6, 4, 9 is also a good choice here. 6, 5, 9 is also good. But uh, I mean, production is good, but then the resources aren't too great. What do I do here? I mean, yeah, maybe I just go for something like six nine five eight five ten. Completely give up on ore and wheat, and just try and focus on the three to one port and the two to one port or for the sheep. Or maybe I can go for 834 instead of 8510. Also, when it comes to pointing my road, pointing to the left, try and go towards 910 makes sense. Uh, 910 will surely be open for me. Maybe instead of 659, I go for something like 6912. This way I can get access to the brick port. Yeah, I think that is slightly better here. So yeah. So now my first objective would be to get to the Maybe 910 wheat port. I mean, the port isn't useful, but then I'm just focusing on a little bit of ore production. Getting to the sheep port would be quite nice. The three to one port, brick port. Yeah, overall seems to be a decent playable setup here. Orange is also in a very decent position, especially with the access to the ore port here. Green maybe goes for something like 6311. Yeah, green can go for 6311 and then red can go for either 5411 but I think 9102 is also decent. Point to the right and then go towards 52 to get sheep production. Yeah, so as expected, green does go for 6311 and points to the left as well. Yeah, green would like to get a settlement on 63 first. Here, red can also go for something like uh, 9, 10, 11 instead of 9, 10, 2. Yeah, it does go for 9, 10, 11 and will point to the left. Yeah, exactly. I actually like this because I would want green and red to fight for the center spot. And here, basically, another 8 is a settlement for me. 8 or a 10. Is directly a settlement and yeah, I get that. That is quite nice here. <clears throat> that said, do I want to go for the brick port here or do I want to go for 910? I can also go for the sheep port, right? Yeah, early on, I think I'll go for the sheep port. Sheep isn't as useful to me as the brick is. So I would rather convert my sheep into other resources, most likely wheat. I 
Okay, so green basically gives up on 5, 4, 11 here. Yeah. yeah fours are absolutely the worst for me. I will go for this because I get a wheat, which is a rare resource for me. And I could have done a two is to one, but I think uh, one is to one is just fine. Yeah, build towards the brick port and end my turn. So red roll the seven. The eight brick is an easy block block here, I would say. And should be targeting orange, but um, not sure might target me as well. Okay, blocks the six sheep. I mean, I get a ore here, but then giving up wheat is also not strong. I mean, I do need to get a settlement first. So basically a 8, 10 or a 9 gives me a settlement on the wheat port, oh sorry, on the brick port here. Okay, orange gets a trade with red. I cannot do anything now. I can go for a dev card, but I don't think that's the best move here. Yeah. Red gets a city as well. The thing is, the block is on the six sheep, which hurts only me and green. And these fours, threes and elevens are helping orange quite a bit as well. Yeah. So here I think my only option is to get a two is to one. I don't think so. Anybody has any word here. Get a settlement and in my turn. Wow. So many threes, fours, elevens here. I would not want these rolls to go on. I mean, all three of those rolls help orange in a very, very big way. And soon I think orange will be able to get another city. I hope green rolls a seven here. I mean, in any case, green here has the best ore wheat sheep. So it's not like green isn't in a strong position. Wow, red ends their turn with 11 cards in hand and now has 14. Hopefully orange rolls a 7 and blocks the 8 ore.
need a seven wow instead of six rolls so orange can get another city or can get a couple of dev cards yeah i think orange would prefer getting a couple of dev cards here no okay instead just goes for a city and yeah i cannot do anything wow So, what? Yeah, red gets a settlement after that, and still has nine cards. Can go for a dev card, I believe, because a ten did roll. Or maybe just goes for a. Yeah, it's difficult to get a dev card. I don't think so. Red has sheep. A twelve would be excellent. Red can build a road towards the old tile, or actually just connect and be on seven points. Okay, so at least green is punished. Needs to block the nine board. Okay, blocks the five. I don't mind that. Six rolls. Maybe I can get a. Yeah. Maybe I can get a ore for a brick here. But orange doesn't need brick. Orange has plenty. Three has rolled some time back. No wheat either. Wow. And this is just absolutely lucky. And I don't think I can do anything here. I can go for a dev card. I think I'll just hold on to these cards. So red takes the longest road here. And yeah, because of those early fours, orange already has a couple of cities. Maybe this is a decent trade uh let's see if i can get this trade this is surely not what i want i can accept this one okay i do get a better one though 
So now I still don't have a city in hand. I need a five to roll. So yeah, I mean, I think Orange just goes for a couple of dev cards here. Doesn't need to think much about actually is building a road settlement. Okay. And still goes for a dev card, I believe. I mean, if I hope for a six to roll, it helps orange. If I hope a nine rolls, it still helps orange. Five is the only roll that helps me. Like even 10 helps red and uh, eight helps orange. So I surely am in a very, very bad position at this game at this point so it seems like orange needed an ore there or a sheep I mean, I'll ask for a one is to two. Even this trade is fine actually, but then I do get a one is to two there. Hopefully no seven. Okay, luckily no seven there. Surely couldn't say I was sure about it. But now I get a city. And I think I'll hold on to these cards. I think the six over is an easy block here. Anything else would be a mistake, yeah. I was thinking of nine, 10 here, but uh, maybe going for six, five, nine would have been slightly better in hindsight. I mean, just better production, right? Mm. And the brick port so far hasn't been very useful. Maybe blocks the nine. Wow, solo blocks red. So here I have a dev card in hand, but I don't think I should be going for any dev cards. Yeah, let's see if red accepts it. How about a trade like this? This still would give me a couple of dev cards. As I said, I don't need dev cards. I mean, this can give me a city. Yeah. So I think I'll just go for another city here. I'm just catching up on production. Red could easily, I mean, these eights are now helping red and orange quite a bit. Especially red with three beats every time and eight rolls. So yeah, red is thinking about it. Maybe red has a mono monopoly. I mean, now if a nine rolls, maybe I can block red. I would need some help. Okay, has a year of plenty. So maybe gets a city or goes for a couple of dev cards. With all those eights that I've been rolling, I think it getting a city would be fine, yeah. Doesn't get a city on 9, 10, 11. I would have preferred 9, 10, 11, just because it helps uh, increasing brick production. Here. I mean, nine wood or maybe the four over here. Not sure. Wow, 
Wow, green is like solo blocking red. Five rolls, so... I mean, now a nine still doesn't help me. I cannot block red. Actually, I yeah, cannot block red at all. So here with the cards I have in hand, I think it's uh, no choice just to go for a monopoly. Red is clearly on nine points here because he hasn't played his uh, dev card. Let's see. Okay, so yeah, orange is clearly on nine now. Yeah, I mean, it's difficult for me to make a lot of progress this game. At least not the way the rolls are happening. Do I block the nine? I think just blocking, I have to target red. Yeah, maybe blocking 9 would have been better. Uh, let's see. I'll try asking if I get it fine. If I don't, that's that as well. Orange is not wanting to help me, which makes sense. Yeah. Maybe building two roads. Actually, yeah, I think I give up on the longest road here. Yeah, it doesn't matter. A little too late. And red wins the game. So, yeah, not much for me to do there. These fives, yeah, threes, fours, and elevens. Very few sixes. But then I think I was just far behind early on in the game. Yeah, and I could never catch up once I lost the lead. Um, also the six block by Red. I mean, Red did win the game in the end. I mean, his production was out of is off the charts. It's much higher than anyone compared. Although total resource score is even for Orange and Red. But still, yeah, I mean, it was a difficult game after all. Don't think I could have done much. And really surprised that Orange did not have any dev cards, sorry, any VPs, and he still did not play it. Yeah, 4, 5, 11, surely very strong numbers here, at least in this game. So yeah, I'll just end my turn. Not much for me to say in this game. And this was my seventh placement game. So three more to go before I get a rank. Anyway, uh, bye for now and see you again in the next video. Bye bye.